Hey guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to build a simple chicken farm. So this will spawn chickens automatically, cook them automatically and put them in this chest. And as you can see, these are also very skinny. Although technically these doors are kind of count as one block. Over here, you could like place this at the back of like your base. To just always have food. And um, I've also just realized that you don't even need this middle block. You can just slam them together. Anyway, I'm going to teach you how to build it. So what you're going to need is, I'm going to say around 64, probably less, of a block of choice. Two hoppers, one dispenser, one chest, one lava bucket, one carpet of any colour, one observer, one stone brick slab, oh, two observers, one stone brick slab and one piece of glass. And can also add trap doors, but I'll show you where to add those. You only need two if you do. So first, you're going to place your chest. Behind your chest, you're going to place your hopper. Then, you're going to go grab two of your block of choice. Going to go and stand in front. Place your dispenser. You can now break those blocks of choice. Shift. And then place your hopper behind that. Then that's the basic stuff. Then all you need to do, you're going to place a slab on top of here. Place your glass on top of your chest. Then you're going to build up around the edges. Like this. Make sure to shift when you place the one on top of the observer. Oh no, dispenser. Then you're going to place your lava here. Then around on top of this, you're going to place your white carpet. Then you're gonna also surround. Oh, then you're gonna also surround that, like so. And if you wanted to add those trap doors, you'll just place one on top of the lava and one on top of the carpet. I'm not gonna add it. So now the way this, if you want to be safe, you should build up that too tall so that the chickens don't fall out. So I'm just going to grab a chicken spawn egg because I don't actually have to do work. But you would probably have to um, build like a staircase and bring them up. And you, this um, like box, it doesn't have to be one. If you want a really efficient farm, you can make it three long, four long. But I'm going to use one. So if, if you do use one, you just got to tap until the chickens start dying. And that's when you hit entity cramming. In bedrock edition, there is no entity cramming. And I realized I accidentally made both mo most of these baby chickens. That doesn't really matter to show my point. So what happens is these chickens will lay eggs. I'm just going to place some eggs in here because as I said I made them all baby chickens by accident. So we're going to get some eggs. The only other step is place a block of choice. Then place two observers. Like so. So they're facing against each other. And these are just gonna fly out the eggs. And when a baby chicken, since it's a baby, it's only half a block tall, so it doesn't get burnt by the lava. But as soon and but baby chickens can't give you any food. But adult chickens can. So as soon as one of these baby chickens grows up to be an adult chicken, it will give you food and it will automatically be cooked because they died by getting burnt. So you'll have cooked meat in here. So I'm gonna grab some seeds to just show you how this would work so you can just feed this oh. <clears throat> and then if you just give it a bit of time and you second now and the feed until he grows up come on there we go he dies and then his drops go into the chest. This one didn't drop any chicken. So we'll go for this guy too. You can just show me the fact that it does cook the chicken. Hmm. Come on. Where's this? They do drop chicken. Like if I spawn an adult chicken in here. 
Wait, hold on. Why are none of you dropping chicken? Oh my god. You're saying this is it. You've cooked chicken. And that's basically gonna be it for today. So hopefully this helped you. If it did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Um. So yeah. Bye. Bye.